What's happening, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Me and Car Keys. So today's video, I have two big announcements, and I can't wait to share with you guys. I'm super excited. Number one, we finally reached 3,000 subscribers on the YouTube channel, and I am so elated and so shocked that we actually got it to this point. It's because you guys, anybody who's ever watched the video, liked the video, subscribed, commented, uh, shared it, anybody who's ever done anything that has to do with me and Car Keys, I do appreciate it. That's why I call y'all the motivation crew, because y'all keep me motivated, and I do my best to keep y'all motivated as well. We finally reached a pinnacle, 3,000 subscribers. Man, <laughs> when I think back to where we started, four cylinder, burgundy, good on gas. Thank you, thank you, that's all I can say, thank you. So to commemorate 3,000 subscribers, there may or may not be a giveaway somewhere towards the end of this video, keep watching. So I think people do these rapid fire Q&As where they sit down and ask a whole bunch of questions and it's real quick, real fast. So I asked people on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, I said, hey, if you have any questions, put them in the comments below, let me know, and I got some really interesting questions, let's go. First question is, what's your name? I actually never said my name on a video, probably. My first name is Rashid. So I go by Car Keys. People have been calling me Car Keys since we started this YouTube channel, which I kind of like, Car Keys. Next question is, what was your first car? My first car was actually a 1978 Ford Thunderbird. It was a uh, dark blue. I got it painted Laguna Blue. Did a couple things to it. Um, I love that car, y'all. I missed that car. I actually still have that car. Next question is, why YouTube? So. YouTube actually started with the kids. So we started a YouTube channel called The Mac Party uh, during the pandemic, because uh, we need something to do. So <laughs> I started a YouTube channel. Um, I started with my daughter. Uh, so we have a lot of kids videos, travel videos, family videos. Go check it out. It is live. Um, I don't really do as much on that channel because I'm doing this channel. But yeah, check it out. All right, the next question is, are you a full-time content creator? No, I am not. However, that would be the dream job. If I could do this every day, all day, that would be the dream job. So the question is, and that's the goal by the way. So the question is, what do I do now? Airplanes. No, seriously, airplanes. <laughs> uh, so I work in the aviation field. And it's funny how airplanes always interrupt my videos, <laughs> but I work in the aviation field. I am actually a tower coordinator for an airline here in Atlanta. Which airline? It's Atlanta, so you can probably guess. <laughs> What's up, y'all? I'm here to introduce you to the all new meandcarkeys.com. Meandcarkeys.com. Meandcarkeys.com is live. On there, you can find behind the scenes coverage, footage of car shows, events, anything we got going on. And you can also pick up some really cool merch to support the channel. Right now, we have the black with the white logo, and we have the gray with the black logo. So come on by meandcarkeys.com. Let me know what you think about the website. Put in the comments below. Uh, any suggestions you might have, put in the comments as well. Uh, this is a great way to support the channel, and I do appreciate your support throughout all this time. Once again, meandcarkeys.com. i see you over there. Back to the video. All right, we're at school. <laughs> we're at my daughter's school waiting to pick her up. All right, where did we leave off at? Uh, what got you into cars? What got you into cars? Okay, how'd you get in the car? I get the question. Okay, <laughs> thanks for the question. Uh, how did I get in the car? So my dad and my brother are both big car guys, right? I grew up watching them uh, fix cars, mod cars, uh, fix this, change that, whatever. My dad was one of those people that would fix it no matter what. He would, he would always try to fix it no matter what. My brother had lowrider magazines like all over the place. Um, every weekend, Saturday, my dad, my brother, and I were detailing cars every single Saturday. And that was our thing. So I loved, that's how I got in the cars. That first car that ever got my attention to where I was into cars was actually a Mustang. Mustang GT, I remember it was red convertible and I, I wanted one so bad and I still want one, but that was the first car that I ever sparked my interest in cars. The next question is, <laughs> when are you gonna put a six inch lift on your truck? So I know exactly who asked that question. Big shout outs to Red Coyote Forest. I know who asked that question. Um, I'm gonna put his link in the description below. Matter of fact, he's a YouTuber. Go out and check his channel. Um, he has an awesome truck and a uh, Mustang. Yeah, so, um, and as a matter of fact, that question is on here more than once because here it is again. Are you going to lift your truck? So let's talk about lift real quick. Um, I, my, the plan was never to lift this truck, right? I always wanted to go a leveling kit and I always wanted to, to have a certain look to it, which is the look it has right now. So I like the look on it, so I'm probably never gonna lift this truck. I actually didn't even want to lift my truck until I saw Red Coyote Forest truck, until I saw City Country Heroes truck, um, and I was like, ah, maybe I should lift my truck. But no, I'm never, I'm not gonna lift my truck. I, I kind of like the way it is now. What is your all-time dream car? Oh, I can't answer that. I cannot answer that question, y'all. Um, <laughs> all right, all right, I'm gonna give you three. Um, number one is to see my 78 Ford Thunderbird um, all done, like new engine, transmission, wheels, tires, interior, new paint, everything. Completely done, customized, modded the way I want to. Um, number one, number two, Aston Martin Vantage. I love the Aston Martin Vantage. The F1, oh, uh, yeah. Uh, number three would be a Lamborghini Huracan. 
Percon, yeah, that would have to be number three. Um, I, I got to give an honorable mention to um, Jaguar F Type. Jaguar F Type R. I love Jaguar F Type R's. Um, yeah, one day, <laughs> one day. Uh, next question is when are you going to start selling merch ah, merch available right now uh next question is do you believe in god a hundred thousand million percent yes ford versus chevy who who asked this question who asked this question ford versus chevy chevy uh, no clearly <laughs> no i'm just playing clearly i'm a ford guy but um i do like chevys uh, especially the classic chevys on um, only new chevys i like are like corvettes pretty much c8 corvette c7 corvette c pretty much all the corvettes but uh yeah ford all right, next question is, what other hobbies do you have besides cars? Ah, good question. Uh, music. So I grew up doing music, uh, producing music, making beats, playing instruments, um, and it's something I still do. Uh, if you, all the music that's on my channel, 99.9% of it, I made. Um, I also play the trumpet, and I still play the trumpet. Uh, other than that, uh, I love working out. Fitness is a big hobby of mine. And other than that, I just love hanging out with my family. Uh, next question is, why the name me and car keys? Good question. So my last name is actually Mac. M-A-C-K, me and car keys. Clever, right? Uh, what's the fastest you've ever driven? <laughs> Can't really answer that question. Uh, no, kidding. Um, the fastest I've ever driven was probably around like 105. It wasn't that fast, like 105. Um, and that was actually in my Thunderbird. So my Thunderbird only went to 80 on the speedometer. Um, I put a four barrel carburetor on it, four barrel intake. And for whatever reason, I decided to push it one day on 20, on I-20 East. Um, I hit it and it went to 80 and it just kept going. <laughs> and when it, the car started to shake around, like maybe 100, 105, I kind of estimated, the car started to shake and I just kind of stopped. Last question is, are you finished with the truck build? No, actually I'm not finished. Uh, there are things that I want to change. The truck kind of took it's a turn of its own. So I had a plan in my head at first and then it kind of took a whole direction, whole different direction. So I kind of, I got a lot of things I want to do still to the truck. And that, honestly, when it comes to modding and customizing vehicles, I don't think you're ever actually done. I know y'all been clowning me this entire video because this truck is filthy. Uh, we are going to clean it up real quick. Um, I really enjoyed making this type of video. I'm going to give it a chance for you guys to get to know me um, based on the questions that you asked. So I really enjoyed it. If you have any other questions, put in the comments below and I'll just compile them and we can do another video just like this if you like this type of content. Now, as far as me and carkeys.com, uh, we do have only t-shirts on the website right now, but there will be more merch added as time goes on. There's already been a request for hoodies for the winter time. So we're going to get on that. If, you, if there's anything else you want to see, put in the comments below, send me an email, let me know. We'll get on it. Now, as I promised earlier, for 3,000 subscribers, we are doing a giveaway. So to the first person that can answer this question in the comments below, we'll get the first me and car keys t-shirt for free. And I will ship it to your door to the first person that can correctly answer this question in the comments below right here. Now, I've only owned three cars in my lifetime. The first one was a 1974 Thunderbird. The last one is this F-150, 2015 F-150. What did I drive in the middle? Now, here's a hint. I didn't actually say it in this video, but it's in this video. All right, once again, thank you for watching another video on the Me and Car Keys channel. Like I said, I really enjoyed this type of video. Um, I do appreciate you guys, 3,000 subscribers. It's, it blows my mind that we've actually gotten to this far in two years. 3,000 subscribers, and it's all thanks to you guys. Motivation crew, thank you for what you do. That's me, that's you. Till next time, I'll see you.